And in 1914, she applied to music school in Philadelphia. She waited and waited and waited to get an application. And then finally she found out that they didn't accept African American students. So that as she became an older singer and, and had stopped singing, many of the singers from the 1970s and 80s and 90s, she was able to have come to her home and she spoke with them and she would give them little tips on how they should carry themselves and what they needed to do to advance their careers. So racism in the opera world is still very alive today. People don't like to talk about it. Um, but it's very difficult for African Americans to get work in the opera, on the opera stage. Even though I'm a classically, sing, a classically trained artist, I believe that you should sing whatever you love. And as long as you sing it using good, healthy technique, it doesn't matter what you sing.